Jaiswal. Today we are going to show you the demonstration about uh, TeamViewer that is an online screen sharing application. Uh, so we will uh, deal with uh, the introduction part of TeamViewer and why we use TeamViewer, how it works, for whom it is, what are the version histories, are there any alternatives for TeamViewer and if you find it useful you can support us by various links or various ways so uh, teamweaver has been ranked as number one by cnet.com under uh, remote sharing applications and it has been given 5 out of 5 rating by download.com 4.5 out of 5 rating by pc mag which are very popular uh, over the internet and uh, this is one of the best uh, online file sharing, online meeting or online conference or screen sharing application that I have uh, ever seen and I am using it from uh, last three years. We can do audio and video chat very well with this application. We can uh, record the presentation, we can uh, deliver the presentation through it. This will be very uh, good for uh, teachers to demonstrate the presentation to their students online and we can use vpn through this this is almost available in all the oss either for linux mac windows even in windows for windows xp vista 2003 2008 98 me for everything and even uh, it is available for uh, smartphones also for ios for android applications and many more so what are the advantages of using uh, TeamViewer? This is easy to use even if you are uh, not uh, so much geek person or a technical person. You can use it with uh, just a small three three easy steps. And uh, this is free for personal use. Uh, you can do video chat with it. You can do audio chat with your friends. And uh, if you are having any problem and if you uh, if you want to get troubleshoot to online then you can use this sharing screen through which you will be able to see that uh, uh, what are the things that the other person is doing on your computer. So this has uh, some advantage over re remote desktop connection of uh, Windows. So there are there are uh, various features which is not available in remote desktop connection like video chat or uh, file sharing using drag and drop so those things and uh, you can use it uh, through smartphones also like if you are having uh, any android phone or ios if you want to uh, share your pc or if you want to access your pc you can do that through that this has one more option if if you are uh, giving a predefined password then you can use it uh, from anywhere over the internet if your computer is alive so what i found as a disadvantage although we can't count is a disadvantage but uh, 7.x version that is the latest version that can connect to the lower versions but lower version cannot connect to the version 7.x what does it mean is suppose you are having version 7 and you are trying to connect to the other pc you are go going to uh, have the remote access of another pc which is of lower version then it is very well applicable here but if somebody is going to access your system uh, who is having lower version of team viewer then this is not possible and still I found that uh, file sharing and VPN connection is little bit complex for a common man now how it works you just uh, need to download it install it and then connect to the partner system but internet connection should be there and uh, the user uh, the ID will be of nine digit and password will be of four digit so you can change the password according to your convenience so you can uh, either allow the partner to access your system remotely or ask for his or her id password so that you can access their systems you can opt for various modes while connecting either remote connection or uh, you specifically for file transfer or you want to connect through vpn or uh, for uh, some meeting 
like online meeting or uh, you can be a host or you can join others meeting either through online or through this software so for full access to online meeting and um, if you want to increase the number of participants then uh, it requires the paid version so there are three paid version for business premium and corporate having uh, different charges for that but sharing files and presentation is allowed in free versions too uh, if predefined password then of course you can access it from anywhere through the internet now who can use it i feel uh, if, if you any anyways if you are going to share your pc or if you are going to access your pc or someone's else pc remotely then this will be very useful software if uh, for personal use you can share your system you can do audio and video chat as i said earlier and you can troubleshoot uh, others system or somebody can troubleshoot your system by remote sharing as i said it is useful for teachers also and for a small business uh, any company small company can help their clients using remote assistance uh, there will there can be online meeting vpn connection and if you are working on some project of a small team so you can do some teamwork through this remote desktop connection also so it was first released in 2005 and gained popularity in no time so the latest versions are 7.0.12979 for windows which is of 3.4 mb and uh, it was released on 19th march 2012 so in the same for linux android ios mac so you can see here it supports almost all the operating systems and it supports more than 30 languages also So teamweaver.com is the official website and if you want to download this software you can download very well from this link or you can go to the website also Is there any alternative CS there are so many alternatives but I feel this is uh, the best among it and I still I prefer teamweaver among all those things like windows remote desktop ultra vnc tight vnc you might have heard about tight vnc log me in so my pc and uh, two other uh, little popular but useful one is dimd and mikogo so if you find it useful you can join us very well at aliencoders.com you can like our facebook page twitter or you can see this video on youtube or you can see this ppt in our slide share and now uh, i will be showing you how we can install it you can use it so first uh, this is uh, this is the home page of uh, team viewer the official website now go to the download link and uh, you can download according to your operating systems like if you are using windows mac c as i am using windows so it already discovered that it's windows so i can uh, download from this link or if you are on mac linux or um, through mobile you can download very well through this links So as I have downloaded already, already. So let's go and install it. Give you the full permission as administration administrator. So I'm running it as an administrator. Continue. Uh, yes, install. You can run it also without installing if you want, but I prefer. Uh, install it and then check all the features of it uh which one you want personal non commercial company or both of the above i will choose personal okay accept it agreed and uh, then next choose the installation type you can choose uh, either yes or no If you are choosing yes, then yes, predefined uh, password should be there, and after that you can use it uh, from anywhere through internet. That's what I was telling you uh, while I was telling the advantages of this. So let it be no only. It's going to install within two seconds. Yes, it got installed. So now you can see you are having ID as uh, 
7422431458 and uh, the password is a four digit so if you are going to share your system you need to share this id and password to the partner or you can ask the partner to share their user id and password then you can use either remote control or uh, file transfer so you can you cannot see vpn connection because while installing uh, i did not allowed uh, the vpn connection because i am not going to use vpn here and uh, for remote transfer remote control and file transfer we don't need vpn what about the meeting so for the meeting now uh, in version 7 you can see the different tab where uh, either you can start uh, instant meeting or you can uh, provide the meeting id your name and you can join it if you are having some meeting id or you can start it so if i am going to start it then how it will show it will come like this so you can share this meeting id to the other partners and then they can be very well uh, join this meeting so you are sure your screen you can share the screens and other softwares you can have conference call also but uh, i mean some charges will be deducted so let's leave it and uh, close it this way you can use the meeting and this way you can use the remote control after this um, as uh, i'll i don't have uh, the another pc or another place where i can uh, use it otherwise i could show you after that how uh, you can uh, use the file transfer or other things but it will be very easy and uh, the small close icon will come at, at the bottom and then you can share your system